Hi guys, welcome back to my channel today. As promised, I'm going to be reviewing these vintage Revlon lipsticks. Vintage Moon Drops lipsticks, number 300 in Frost. I did get these secondhand. Gold Mist Bronze in the green tube. These were out in the 80s and 90s and they took them away and now they are reselling for nearly $100 online. And I did not get them online, but I am planning on selling them. Copper Glaze Brown Moon Drops Luminous by Revlon. And let me show you. And then the last one, Outrageous Lip Color Number 8. It's a frost and it's called Great, it's called Number 80 in Great Bronze. Gorgeous, gorgeous gold tube. I don't remember, I've been using Revlon since I was probably about 14 years old. I remember these. I remember the outrageous line of shampoos and conditioners. And then of course the black tubes. I have no memory whatsoever of these gold tubes. I don't know when they came out. Um, if anybody knows, comment below, cause these are gorgeous. I thought they were actually like Estee Lauder, which I don't have my Estee Lauders here. I have some vintage Estee Lauders I did a video on and they come in these tubes as well. So what I'm gonna do is I will try them on with any vintage product. They always say, you know, try them on at your own risk. I like to use a little Vaseline just as a barrier before um, I try them on. But I will swatch them for you and show you how they look. If anybody remembers having these moon drops or the outrageous Revlon lip, comment below and let me know. Okay, so the first one is number 300 and it's Gold Mist Bronze. And by the sticker number 300, it looks like a pinky color. So let's open her up. Wow, like a fuchsia color maybe? And it's a frost and it is kind of screaming 80s. So I'm going to put it right here so you could see on a skin. Woo, almost like the color of my watch. So blue undertone fuchsia. And then I'm going to swatch it on an envelope. Okay, and then I'm going to add some Vaseline as a barrier to my lips, just in case. They don't have any odors or smells or anything like that. That is how you tell your lipstick has turned and gone bad. Lipsticks usually last about three years. And obviously these ones are 30, you know, 30 years old. Okay, so I am using my phone. So if you see me look this way, I am trying it on. And then I will look this way to show you. So yeah. Okay, oh, very smooth over that. Wow, beautiful. I really like this, it's like an everyday color. Blue undertone, fuchsia pink, and that's what it looks like. Very pretty. I think it would look good on blondes, brunettes, redheads. Very perfect. So that is what she looks like. Again, that's number 300, it's a frost, and it's called Gold Mist Bronze Gold. Does it have gold flecks in it? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I don't see any gold flecks, but. All right. Yeah, I'm not seeing any. So that is the first one. And I'm going to take it off. I use these little um, say. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it. And these work really good for waterproof mascara and for lips. So just take it off. They work excellent. All right. Bear. Okay, so next we're going to try the Copper Glaze Brown in Lumin Luminisk, Luminisk formula. There's like cream, sheer, pearl, and that is what that looks like. And I will swatch her. I'm gonna like this color. I already know. This is screaming fall at me. And then I'm gonna do it on the, um, on top of the fuchsia color. Like a brownie color. I really like it. All right. Some barrier. And trying it on. Gosh, that is gorgeous. Um, I would have called it cinnamon. Cinnamon. <laughs> I don't know why. Brownie cinnamon. Wouldn't it be fun to, to be, have the job of naming lipsticks? So that's that color. Very pretty, complimenting. I think it would look really good on brunettes as well. So we have that one. And then the last one, again, let's take it off. OK. 
okay? The last one was that outrageous um, gold metal, and that's called Great Bronze. It's a frost and it's number 80. Great Bronze, and let's swatch it. Woo, beautiful. Sorry, they're mowing the lawn. And I'm gonna put it right on top there. And let's try it on. Oh, my gosh, okay. I forgot the, the barrier. <laughs> Okay, now let's try it on. A little darker. Very shiny. Gosh, that is... That's kind of reminding me of a Lancome one that I have. And that's what that looks like. It is beautiful. Look at that. And again, that is Great Bronze number 80. Thank you so much for watching my little reviews. And take care. Bye-bye.